doctor, doctor, doctor. Alright, that's our girl, girl, girl. She had to see her tent. She was, she was, she was. He ripped her apart. Like a saber cat tears a deer. We barely found enough of her to bury. I could drive a man to do something like this. Stewing in the pit while we figure out what to do with him. Come to gawk at the monster? Believe me, it wasn't anything I ever intended to do. I tried to tell them, but none of them believed me. It's all on account of this blasted ring. I was told it could let me control my transformations. Perhaps it used to, but I'll never know. Persing didn't care for my taking it and threw a curse on it. I put it on, and the changes just came to me. I could never guess when. It would be at the worst times. Like with the little girl. I've been looking for a way to appease her scene. There is a certain beast in these lands. Large, majestic. It's said that her scene will commune with whoever slays it. Oh my. You would do this for me? Here, take it. I, I don't want anything to do with this wretched thing anymore. I wish you luck. But you leave here while I still have my skin. Should our paths cross again, I will remember your kindness. Farewell. <laughs> But more will come. Bring him down for the glories of Lord Hirsin. Stop you if that's what you want to do. Her is too powerful. If you spare me, I can be a powerful ally to you, and I would promise to never return to civilized life. 